Lesson 1. Creating a Console Application in Visual C++ 2010. To follow along with this lesson, you will need to have Visual C++ 2010 installed. If you have not yet installed Visual C++ 2010, you can download it for free from Microsoft. Just follow the instructions in our Lesson 0 video. To begin, you should have Visual C++ 2010 open like this. Then left click File in the menu bar, mouse over New, and left click Project in the submenu. This will bring up the new project dialog shown here. Left click the region labeled Win32 Console Application, and left click the box next to Name, and enter Lesson 1 into the box. Finally, left click the OK button to go on. This brings up the Win32 Application Wizard shown here. Left click the words Application Settings to go on to the Application Settings. On the Application Settings page, left click the box next to Empty Project and left click the Finish button to create the project. With the project created, your IDE should now look like this. Next, we need to add a code file to hold our program. Left click Project in the menu bar and left click Add New Item in the submenu. This will open the Add New Item dialog as shown. Left click the C++ file icon, then left click the box next to Name and enter main.cpp. Then left click the Add button to finish adding the file main.cpp to the project. You should now see this. Left click the region under main.cpp and enter this code. With the program now written, we want to compile and execute it. In the menu bar, left click Debug, and then left click Start Debugging in the submenu. This will bring up a dialog telling you that the project is out of date and asking whether you would like to rebuild it. Left click the S yes button. If you have typed the code incorrectly, the project will build, the code will execute, and you will see this window with the words Hello World in it. You have just written a C++ program. Press Enter whenever you would like to close the program. One final important point remains. Due to changes in the IDE, many of the programs in our later C++ console lessons will require this line of code in order to keep the window open. This line keeps the program running and the window open until you press the Enter key. So be sure to add it at the end of the main function, otherwise the window will pop up and close before you can see anything. If you have problems with this or other lessons, please consult our lesson pages for more information. There you can also download the code and project. You may also post to our forum so that we can help you to find a solution or make a clarification. This concludes the lesson.